Hey everybody, it's Nick V917 and this is part 60. I'm gonna walk through Paper Mario in the Thousand Year Door, and you can't see me. But anyway, uh, in this episode we're gonna head for Key Hall Key, but before we do, I know I keep forgetting these sorts of things, but there's a ship panel right here, so you know, I probably could have did this back when we were talking to Luigi and Hazy for uh the his story, but I don't know, I just forgot. But anyway, over here, uh it doesn't look like there's anything over here. But look closely, you might be able to see a chest. And over here, we got the HP Drain. It drops Mario's attack power by one, but you regain one HP per attack. Uh, that's kind of interesting. And there's a star piece. Probably not going to use it, though. Uh, really don't have any interest in it. But, now I think we've got taken care of everything that we need to do. So, yeah, now we actually get to call in our favorite of Cortez, so let's head for the island. Wait, where the frick did he go? He just literally vanished. Okay, it was just too far away from the camera. Still, that was weird how that happened. Yo, Cortez, what's up? You going to Quijarqui, amigo? Excellent. Muy bueno. To the sea we go, amigo. Set sails. Destination Quijarqui. Sweet. I loves me some paper jokes. I know I said I may have said this before, but I still think that at the start of this LP I should have uh, done one of those things like what Proton John is doing for his Superman 64 LP, and uh, just uh, saying a or like having a little paper jokes counter going on all throughout the LP. That might have been interesting. Probably would have had the same number of paper jokes as Superman 64 had glitches. But, um, tish. Alright, so now that we're here, let me see if we can do something really quickly. I want to see if we can get another Wackus bump. Although, I'm pretty sure that you can only have one on you at a time. Oh, I guess not. You are really freaking trusting. And that is your downfall, Wacka. Wacka, Wacka. So I think I have two of those things on me now. Yeah, I have two Wackus bumps. Sweet. Alright, so Frankie and Francesca, they're somewhere on the island. And now we have to find them, or the Mafia will kill us! Let's see here, is there anything over there? Hang on, I wanted to talk to Nia. I'll show you accent one more time. Oi, Captain Stash! What the Piontas? Oh, they're in the jungle looking for something, I think. Aha! A clue! And actually, I need to rest really quickly. Because I don't have hardly any flower points left. I still can't believe they're pay making us pay 10 coins to sleep on wood. Seriously. I could just sleep out in the forest if that was the case. And just have somebody stand guard so that the fuzzies don't munch on my brains. <sighs> Craziness. Anyway, let's get Bobbery back out. He'll be m more useful than anybody else, I think. Oh, wait, no. I need to have a crush out because I want to show off Stampede. Anyway, I think... There they are! Oh, hey, it's Mario. How you been there, pal? We do something for you? What? The boss is sick? Oh, poor daddy. Oh, no. At a time like this. At a time like this, you say? See, I, uh, I dropped the wedding ring Frankie gave me out around here. I can't possibly leave it until I find that ring. Otherwise, something, something might eat it. It must be somewhere between here and that skull rock. Listen for a second, my fuzzy little coconut. Shouldn't we forget about that ring for now and check on the boss? I just realized every single mafia guy sounds exactly the same. Oh well. <clears throat> How could you say that, Frankie? That ring was the symbol of our love. We have to find it. We have to! Or maybe you just don't love me anymore, is that it? 
Oh, you're gonna pull that card, are you? Oh, that's just me. Of course I love you, my little bacon burger. Mmm, <laughs> bacon burgers. <laughs> None of your sweet talk now. You have to say uh, you love me a hundred times. A hundred times? If you love me, you'll have to say it, Frankie. <sighs> Come on now, babe. Of course you are. Of course I love you, my little short stack. Now please, let's go. No! You have to say it 99 more times, Frankie. Oh, fine, you crazy dame. I love you. 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 Uh. Yeah, so he literally does this a hundred times. And it keeps track for you! So, yeah, you can just pretty much button mash through all of this. And, yeah. Thank goodness that she doesn't raise the stakes afterwards. Like, what happened in uh, Paper Mario 1 when you were in uh, the dry, dry desert and you have to hit that block a hundred times. And I joked around, hey, maybe, at least there's not a block where you have to hit it a thousand times. Thankfully, they didn't, like, take that idea and put it in here. That would suck. Anyway, 85, 86, 87, 89, 90, 91, they do. Yay, we're almost there. I love you. <sighs> yeah, I said it. Oh, Frankie, baby. You're such a silly Billy. <laughs> Now, my little cream puff, let's find that ring right away. What do you say? Wow, you think this guy's gonna be alright looking for that thing on their own? Listen, Mario, we better play it safe and help them out, don't you think? Yeah, I guess so. But yeah, I think that the ring is off somewhere over here. Just check around bushes and all that jazz. Whoa! And watch out for the future piranhas! I do not want to deal with. You guys are a holes. You know what? You're getting stampeded on, bitches. So, watch it. You alternately press L and R to do this. And... <laughs> so mother-effing happy. <laughs> I like that one. And let's just go ahead and finish off these two with multi-bounces. Fair enough. Sorry if you can hear that. My dog is scratching. Probably need to put some flea medication on her. So, where the frick is it? Hope it's not all the way back where uh, the skull rock is. That would be annoying. Alright, let's do the same thing we did before. Get flurry. Distract you. Crush. Actually, I don't think that you have to fight him unless you actually physically run into him, so that's a thing. So, anyway, uh, let's see here. It must be somewhere over here. Uh, if I don't find it in any of the bushes, I'll check all the trees on the way back and went in for fun. That could have come in handy earlier. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Is that grass? No. <laughs> is that Luigi? Maybe. It is all the way back over here, isn't it? I'll just bet you. Wait. Dang, they made that thing tiny! I mean, I would have missed that if I didn't have such good vision thanks to my glasses. But, uh, yeah, that was kind of hard to see. I mean, if, uh... I mean, here, here's just something to think about. Did you see the size of the ring that was on Frankie's hand? That that, that thing was huge. Then again, Piantas have huge fingers, but still. And that ring was definitely not the same size. There you go. Ah, that's it! That's my ring! You found it! Frankie, now we can go home to Daddy! We sure can, my little cheese and cracker. Let's go. Well, so anyway, we'll be down at the dock. Hurry back, please! Alright, well that was easy enough. Actually no, that was rather complicated and we used FP again. Now we're running low. Again. I could probably really stop real quickly. Uh, since I have the in coupon, I could just go ahead and use that. Otherwise it would just be taking up space and I don't need that. I just took the mail. 
I don't know that person. Oh, okay. He was just saying he liked my comment on the escapist. Yes, I, I make comments on. Or, I like a lot of the videos on the escapistmagazine.com. I don't know if you guys know about that site yet. It has uh, zero punctuation and uh, escape to the movies and lots of great programming. And I comment on there a lot. So, let's do this. Okay, Mario. I think we're ready, pal. Yeah, we are. Let's go back to World Port. Oh, Daddy, please hang on until we get back. All right, let's go, Cortez. Return to Rogueport, amigo. Bueno, we are off. Cast off, me amigos, to Rogueport. And why did they just shrink? Seems to me like you could have made the paper joke just as easily if you just, you know, flipped it. <sighs> Weirdness. So, yeah, now we have to go back there. Yeah, let me see, which comment did he like? Da -de -da -de -da, see comment. Oh, okay. It was something about. Yeah, I might mention it later, but right now it's not important because we're back in Roport. We have to go see Daddy immediately. You got it, Francesca. But um, yeah, basically, uh, it was this. Uh, it was from this show called No Right Answer, and they were discussing which is a better medium for, like, like uh, movie characters, CGI, or puppetry. And it had uh, one of the things in it, had, or one of the pictures in the background was of the movie Kung Pao Enter the Fists, and I was like, wow, I need to watch that movie again, because that was ridiculously awesome. I mean, seriously, if you haven't seen that movie, what are you waiting for? You need to watch it now. In fact, you need to watch it yesterday. Like, what, get off your butt. It, it's on the internet somewhere. You're on the internet right now. You can find it. Anyways. Daddy! 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 Wake up! Open your eyes! Boss! Da 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 Kissed him? Well, that was quick. Daddy! Boss! Oh, my little friend Jessica. Came back for me. You too, Frankie. Of course we did, Daddy. Soon we heard you were ill, we dropped everything and rushed back. Friend Jessica. Frankie. That was wrong. I was a stubborn old man. Forgive me. I know I may regret saying this, but... I want the two of you to stay is the two of you to stay here with me. Can't bear to be away from you two crazy kids. I'm an old man now. I need peace. <laughs> I guess the time has come for me to stop being so selfish, causing everyone trouble. Looks like the Don P even Don Pianta, the dawn of untimely death, can't escape the old age. Time has come everyone. I'm gonna retire. Can't be well nobody no 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 it's time. I mean it. I want you to be my successor, Frankie. What do you say, Frank? As of today, you're the new head of the Pianta Syndicate. What? But boss, you still got it in you. You're spring chicken. You don't need, you don't gotta do this. I mean, me, boss? No, you're the one, Frankie. I've been thinking about that for a long time now. You'll do just fine, kid. I got a good feeling. You know, I got a feeling about you. A good one. I want you to take care of Francesca and the rest of Syndicate, the way I did. Boss! You, Mario. Looks like you've done yet another favor for me, kid. Yeah, about that, boss. Oh, this is gonna be just beautiful. I know it. What did you guys do? Well, uh, we kinda promised him something, boss. We told him if we... We told him we'd get him a ticket for the Excess Express if he brought your daughter. Whoa, is that all? You had me worried for a second. Come on over here, Mario. How many do you want? One, two, ten? Help yourself. Well, that was easy enough. Uh, I'm guessing eight. One for Mario and one for all its partners. Oh, yeah. You come back anytime you like. How about that? 
Yay, the mafia doesn't want to kill us. Well, now that I've retired, I'm going to get out of here. Daddy. Boss. You the boss now, Frankie. You got that? You. The boss. You do good now, Frankie. He's a good man. Good Pianto. Frankie, you got lots of work to do. And don't worry, I'll keep you in line. Sweet bean, come on. Knock it off with the pet name nonsense, please. Call me Francesca. Huh? Uh, Francesca? Yes, or Mrs. Boss. T. Under Boss? Uh, I mean, Boss? You got our loyalty. We'll be by your side whenever you need us, Boss. Thank you so much, Mario, for everything. You're welcome here anytime. You're like a brother to me. You ain't bad, kiddo. Yeah, you ever think about joining up with the Syndicate? The life, kid. <laughs> Kids! I hope you're watching this. Join the Mafia. It's really cool. You get all sorts of perks, like... The ability to kill without impunity. But anyway... Yes, yes, yes! We can go to Pajli Heights! Yes! That six crystal stars as good as ours! Wee! <laughs> I heard that, my uglies. I heard that! Where did that come from? So the six crystal stars in Parsley Heights, is it? That's a rather nice piece of information. Thanks ever so. Oh, bugger. Hey, you're that Beldum! Normally this would be where I finally deal with you in that homely traitor Vivian. But something tells me that trying to that alone would be unwise. So you live. For now. Instead I'll just beat you to Parsley Heights in that crystal star before you do. Wee! Oh, bugger. Whoa, that's out of bad. We gotta get to Parsley Heights before that witch. That is almost the word that I was thinking of to describe her. Let's make tracks for Rogueport Station. Well, we will be doing that in the next video, and hopefully the, uh, Beldum doesn't get too much of a head start while we wait for the next episode. But anyway, so, <laughs> this has been NickyV917 saying thanks for watching, and stay tuned. I don't give a damn about your emails! For part 61, I'm going to walk through on Paper Mario and the Thousand Year Door. See you guys later.